Alright, we have another Pike and Shot Skirmish Battle. This is a mirror to a, another match I have against Awesome 4, which I am fielding the polls. This time I have the German States. So, we've got a very nice flat open cavalry map, which is good news for his polls, and not as great news for my Germans. Uh, we've got Landsnacht Infantry, which these guys are great at fighting other infantry. Unfortunately, we're not going to be facing a lot of other infantry. We're going to be facing cavalry. Um, skirmishing crossbowmen are actually going to be a good buy here. They can evade, they can occupy rough ground, and their crossbows are fairly effective against horse. We'll certainly grab our hussars, light horse with bow. Uh, it might be worth... Oh, we have artillery. Good. We'll try to get these guns up on this hill and command as much of the field as possible. Um, skirmishing arquebusiers are also a good buy. Um, yeah, these are 400 man units of light foot. You don't really see that in Field of Glory. Now for our cavalry, um, we have good cavalry, but we just don't have that many of them, which is awkward. We'll have to grab demi lancers and lit gendarmes. These are average quality horse. They're named somewhat awkwardly because their troop type isn't actually gendarmes. They can move four tiles because they're lightly armored. Well, lightly armored, relatively speaking. Um, yeah, I, unfortunately, I think I need to max out on cavalry, even though my cavalry is kind of overpriced. Gendarmes, uh, raiders even, they lack impact, but they have melee pistol. And I think I even want mounted arquebusiers, leaving 160 points for infantry. Do I want more Lanzacks? I don't think I do. Um, I could get, I think, more crossbowmen to fight the cavalry. And then these mass arquebusiers are going to have a lot of trouble maneuvering. Um, they will get ridden down by horsemen of any sort, and even against his drabi, uh, those have 50% light spear, so they can charge. It's kind of bad, but at the same time, I think I'd rather have, like, th three units of arquebusiers and one unit of crossbowmen and then get one more unit of lastaths, which, you know, it's, they're gonna have trouble catching horsemen, it's kind of pointless, I think. Okay, deployment. Uh, I saw some forest saying that both of the maps are better for him than for me. Um, yeah, that's quite possible. I mean, this is a good, good Polish map, but work with what we have. You get these out of the way so I can think. That's the best spot for my guns, but I don't think I'll have time to unlimber them there. So instead, let's plunk them there. I'm going to put crossbowmen on this hill and arquebusiers in this ground here. Uh, probably won't do. Probably need to just push them up. We might, if we're lucky, be able to push some light infantry here, although not sure how useful that'll be because he has his own infantry, which is pretty high quality. What do I do with these lens nets? Probably put them here so if there is infantry we can confront it. 
Hmm, not optimistic. Next turn. Oof, that is a lot of units. Well, I brought all the cavalry I could. We'll see if it's enough. Try to get into this rough ground with our lights while our massed infantry occupies this rough. And here, That is also awkward. We need to stretch the line a bit to the left. All right, we'll have to shoot it out here, and then when that, whichever part of his line gets close first, just charge it and try to break through. Next turn. Well, I am intimidated. It's a nice flat open field and that's a lot of horsemen. Past cohesion check there. Good. Something like that. There's going to be a lot of cohesion test shenanigans here. We need to hold these units so that our gendarmes or Landsnest can come back and rescue them. And we need the lights to evade and hopefully the right direction to expose the enemy's flanks. Next turn. Ouch. Thank you. 
just at a charge range with his infantry corpse. Hold for a turn. That's good. Now where do they run to? If we push this infantry here, we'll get in range of muskets and rough ground, which we don't want. They held firm. That's too bad. I don't really want to waste fire on pursuing troops. It's at minus 50%, but otherwise we expose our flanks to them or have to push into the open, both of which are not good. At least these horse don't have impact capabilities. Very good. Come on. No. Well, send in the gendarme, send. That did not go according to plan. So neither unit has impact capabilities, both need shooting units, but my men are armored and have melee pistols, which are advantage over melee swords and open terrain. We have to hope to break these shooty cavalry before we get surrounded. These lights are just kind of sacrificing themselves. Ah, right. The priority charge target system uh, makes it so that if I move here, they're exerting a primary zone of control, so I cannot charge one of these two units, which is extremely unfortunate. So we will have to risk one round of fire from these Drabi. Okay, this is bad, this is good, this is good, but the far end could be bad. Uh, some forces, this will be over fairly quickly. Will it? Oh, let's see what he saw. Ouch. Goodbye, my light infantry. Hold. Oh. 
Yeah, I don't know about this over quickly business. It's looking pretty even to me. Okay, well, we charge. Could try to just roll this up. I wonder what it would lead to. We'd probably just end up contacting this unit, which is not extremely desirable. Oh, it sounds fun. Let's just do it. Probably wasn't the right call. They'll break and then we'll get rear charged here. Too late. Did the dumb thing without thinking about it. Unless. Well, no. If I move here, I'll get shot and then charged. And then just lose this unit instead of both of these units. So if we charge here, we're still exposed to a rear charge. Of pike kales are immune to flank attacks, but can be rear charge, but we're going to do it anyway and just hope that we break them down in the melee phase. Okay, which horrible combat do we take? Uh-huh. Good. Right, you move aside. They're screwed anyway, I'd rather sacrifice one unit than lose two. This, these gendarmes will probably pursue into these volley banners. Probably, but it's not guaranteed. Ah, damn it. Fine. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about over quickly. We're breaking up some of the shooty cavalry, but my infantry is caving in pretty hard, and we're losing this hill. So. We'll see. Next turn. Mm, I was hoping those knights would do something a little bit more useful. Do we pursue? That would be... No, oh, we don't. So we're still potentially exposed to a charge, I think.
Oh, good. Shut them off, and maybe... No. Oh, now they're screwed. Once they're disrupted in melee against swordsmen, they're just... it's over. Oh no! <laughs> uh, close match, 4% discrepancy. Ouch. That'll even things out nicely for him. <laughs> no! Okay... Um... This will push against these. Disrupted Lancer Banners, Pikemen, for what it's worth. Oh, what a mess. Break them. Oh no, don't do that. Don't do that. And he said it was going to be over quickly, but I think he could... Pull this off. Well, nothing to do but stand. Ugh, very nice. Could still just get disrupted by musketry and then charged, but it's something. See them off. And wheel around. Ouch. Ouch. Very painful. I think you could have this. Next turn. Here he was being all, all pessimistic, and now my army is just collapsing into flight. Well, he wasn't necessarily wrong that it was going to be over quick. I don't think he expected it to be over quick in this way.
Well, let's get some hits in before it's all over. They'll just fall back. Yep. Have to tank a volley or no? Oh, that didn't work out. That's it. Next turn. Yeah, should be over. And there we go. We are defeated. Um, so like Awesome Force said, maybe I should have invested in rather less um, skirmishers or shooting foot that ended up just getting charged and broken here anyway and brought along one more unit at least of pikemen to help anchor that situation. Although, with the battlefield like this, I'm not sure that it would have saved me. But uh, as he says, I think it would have been the right call. So good game, and until next time.